Something else I wanted to show you guys, just in case you don't know. One thing I do hear is when producers are collaborating, sometimes people will ask for stems. When you export the stems, the problem with it is anything you have on the master channel doesn't get exported, just the regular way. So I'm gonna show you guys how to export for a collab when you're sending someone stems or you wanna get a track mastered. When you export, you'll set it to all individual tracks. And there's this option, just in case you didn't know, include return and master effects. You wanna turn that on. Then when you export it, anything that's on your master is gonna reflect your individual tracks. If you have any kind of effects on your master, any kind of saturator, clipper, anything like that, you wanna make sure you include return and master effects is on. One thing to know is, if you use that, all your master effects and return effects and everything are going to be on the individual tracks, but it will take longer to bounce. There might be some times where you don't want to include return and master effects, but if you're in a collab, that's the way you want to send your stems. So for anyone in Ableton, that's a big cheat code. <laughs>